Just getting into the water is a challenge for Eric Payne, but for him, being with the other veterans made it all worthwhile. We have commonality and we have common experiences and there's things that we will, that we know about and we can laugh about where other people would, you know, really not understand where the humor is really at. Payne left the military in 2007 after losing his left leg in a motorcycle crash. He was an early advocate of the Soldier On program, which started the same year. It helps current and former soldiers deal with both physical and mental injuries through sport. Over the past nine years, Soldier On has spent $4 million offering programs across the country from fishing to yoga to horseback riding. More than 2,200 people have taken part. Five veterans signed up for this scuba course, the first one the program has offered. The new divers were clearly having fun both underwater and on the surface, but they credit Soldier On with delivering far more than that. Honestly, it saved my life. It brought me out of a really dark place, and uh, I don't think I'd be around. Really uh, allowed me to know that um, I wasn't the only one. When I was uh, suffering hard and in a dark place, I thought, it's just me, and I wouldn't tell anyone. And when veterans get together, they work together. It just comes naturally. And we feel very comfortable in our own surroundings. Like we can kind of talk to each other in our own language and we kind of understand what each other is going through or relate to it. And the working together continued underwater with a group shot unfurling a soldier on banner and a final message about what it all means. If there's anybody out there who is hurting and is thinking about becoming active again, they need to get involved in Soldier On because it is a lifesaver. David Pate, CBC News, St. Margaret's Bay, Nova Scotia.